In this screencast, we're going to look at the idea of setting up your gradebook uh, so that it's weighted. Um, the idea of weighted grades in Moodle means that um, you may want to put more of an emphasis on a particular assignment or an activity over others. And so you're able to distribute 100%, which is Moodle's um, course total, so that the total percentage your course runs on is based on 100%. It can't be 200% or 300%. And so you're able then to distribute a certain amount of weight based on 100% to various activities or assignments. So that's why I'm going to show you how to set that up today. So it's the idea of weighted grades. So when you first get into your course and your interface, you want to scroll down and under the administration block, we're going to click on grades. Okay, you see I've added a few grades in here and all these folks are teachers or instructors here. Um, and I'll move their faces off the screen there. Um, and there's no, these aren't actual assignments or anything. I've, these are all fictitious numbers, so don't, don't worry about it. Um, but I want to show you how to set this up and how I've gone about it. So in the top left-hand corner, you want to click on Choose an Action. And when that menu drops down, we're going to go to Simple View underneath Categories and Items. So when you drop into this view and your screen refreshes, under the aggregation category, let's go ahead and drop this down. All right, and here's where you want to choose weighted mean of grades. Okay, those of you that did this previously that had to create categories with the upgrade, it's a little bit different. There's not a need to create categories. You still can create categories, um, which is a different tutorial, um, and that you can actually weight entire categories and groups of that manner. Um, but right now, for this tutorial, we're looking at just the individual assignments. So choose weight and means of grade. Now you can see over here, I've set my weights already. And these are just a matter of you know, highlighting, deleting, and it's based on um, percentage again, and it's out of 100. Okay. So I'm going to give, so the how to use the lesson module is going to be weighted for 20% of the grade. Okay, and it has a max grade of 10 points set to it. So what that tells me is that if they get 100% of the assignment, so if they reach all 10 points on the assignment, that's worth 20% of their total grade. Same down here. The reading assignment is worth 40% of their total grade, 40%. All right, so you see 40, 40, 20, that equals 100%. Okay, this assignment has a max of 100 points. This assignment has a max of 100 points. So if I, once you've made those changes, and you can distribute the points in decimals, um, you know, you could even then do it in fraction because of the way you can align your decimals. So you have some versatility there, and you just have to keep in mind that you're, you're searching for that 100%, and it needs to be within that range. So once you've done that, to be able to save everything, we want to make sure that we come down here and click Save Changes. Okay, now once your changes have been saved, we can come up here to grades and we'll go back into the gradebook. And now what you're able to see is that if we look right here at Deanna, she remember she got 10 points, so that's 100% on this assignment. But this assignment is worth 20% of the grade. For the reading assignment, she have received 50 points, which would have been 50% um, of the assignment. And keep in mind that this activity is assigned 40% of the grade. Over here, she received 100%, so she got 100 points. Um, and this assignment is worth 40% of the grade. So if you add up, you have 40% of the grade, 40% of the grade, 20% um, of the grade. It comes out to an 80% as far as her course total. Okay. Now, you know, it's kind of like a following the bouncing ball type scenario here, so you got to keep in mind what all the assignment values are worth and whatnot. Um, so she literally got, um, because of her 50% on this, um, which is worth 40% of the grade, so essentially she took 20% of that 40% available, and that's how we, when you add this up, you essentially can look at it as 20, 20, 40 is going to give you 80. Because of the 40 available here, she only received 20 percent of it because we set it to a weighted of 40 percent and so she received half of that weighted percentage and so that's how we get to this 80 percent mark so it kind of gives you an illustration of how you can determine 
um, an assignment or activity's worth or value in the course, and not just based on the point value, but the actual disperse, um, how you disperse the value of the assignment into the final grade.